morning, everyone, and welcome back here to Comic Vantage. Ooh, I almost knocked over my box on my coffee. So we got something a little different today. I have a product review coming at you. Uh, I, recently, I was contacted by a Mike and Kelly at Red Wolf Collectibles, and they were like, hey, we saw your review that you did on the slab stand, and we sell something that's very similar. We want you to check it out. But they not only sell these slab stands, but they also sell like acrylic cases, like wall hangers and stuff, and customized journals and things like that. It's really cool. They have a really nice Etsy shop. And uh, I'll be linking that in the description below so you guys can check it out for yourself. But anyway, uh, back to my product that I got. Let me get some coffee here. They were like, hey, do you want to check out one of our stands? And I was like, yeah, that'd be awesome. Send it on over. And uh, the next question was, is they were like, do you have some kind of theme that you want for your stand? And I was like, you know what? I sure do. I was like, oh, I want something to go with this beauty right here. Yes, this is my commission from Patrilla, or Priscilla Petrates down in uh, Brazil. She's also currently working on a book called Chariot for Upshot Comics. She recently worked on Rat Queens for Image. So yeah, I had, she did this for me and I was like, I really, really want to stand for this. So give me something Star Wars themed. And they were like, no problem. Let's do this. So I received this in the mail, oh, I don't know, about three days ago. Uh, kills me not to open the packages, but Three days is like probably my shortest wait ever for opening a package. So let's tear into this and see what they sent. What do you guys say? I love reviewing new products. Oh, man, what do we got here? Woohoo! That's awesome. It looks like we've got an acrylic sheet. It says right there, this is the backstop. All right, there we go. Give that nice shout out. Red Wolf Collectibles. Redwolfscollectibles.etsy.com. Like I said, I will also link this down in the description below. It's a great little sticker. I love that. Nice box, too. I've actually seen these before. If I'm not mistaken, these are trading card boxes. <laughs> I used to have a bunch of these back in the 90s. Oh, how I wish I still had those cards. Man. Whenever new cards came out from, like, Marvel or whatever, I would buy entire cases full. Yeah, it's shocking how those trading cards from the 90s are really exploding in value. Oh, let's see. Look at this. We have... Nice business card for Mike Wolf. Awesome. Like I said, I'll link all the information down below. We have instructions. Customized graded comic display stand. Package contents. One display stand, one acrylic spacer, a oh, one one eighth inch acrylic spacer, and one one sixteenth inch acrylic spacer. Graded comics from CGC, PGX, and CBCS do not require a spacer. Other holders, such as the Ultra Pro One Touch, are thinner and may require a spacer. I have this in a Gator Guard, which is slightly thinner than a CGC book, but probably about the same size as CBCS. So let's see if that requires a spacer or not. Even works with no holder using the backstop. So you can put your own little book in there. Oh, yeah, look at that. I actually have it with the backstop. You can just put in a bagged and boarded comic to hold up your book. That is very, very cool. Future proofing, modifying your holder. One added benefit of each stand purchased from Red Wolf Collectibles is that they can be modified for a different character. Oh, okay, because they put their own acrylic plates on them and they, can, they come apart and you can customize them and have them send you new ones. Customization packs coming soon. That is really, really awesome. I dig that. All right, I'm excited to tear into this thing now. Let's see what we got. So it probably will not require the back snap. I 
I have not seen this yet. I haven't even seen pictures of it. So I'm going to be just as surprised as everyone else out there when I open this up. This thing is packed extremely well. Here are the spacers. They even laser etch everything. Oh, where's my camera going there? So you can see the size of the spacer. 1 16th, 1 8th. Awesome. So far, very, very impressed. And man, this thing is actually really heavy. Okay, here we go. Oh, look at that. That is awesome. The guy sent him a picture of the book. I was like, just go off of this. <laughs> This is so neat. Look at that. This is a beautiful acrylic panel. And this is what they talk about it being future proof. You can just take these screws off and put a new panel on there. Look at this on the side. The Phoenix logo. And Sabine actually always paints. The symbol of the ghost crew, which I think was eventually supposed to evolve into the Rebel logo, if I'm not mistaken. And then Sabine Wren on the back in graffiti because she is a graffiti artist. Wow, this thing is insane. Man, it's heavy. Wow. This is so cool. You know, at first glance, I thought it was actually made out of wood. But I think these panels are molded. Because look, Red Wolf Collectibles right on the bottom. Looks like there is some wood inside, just so they can channel this out. Oh, this thing is so neat. Whoa, that is serious right there. And these are $38.99 a piece. And it sounds like it's weighted down. Either like, like lead shot or something in there. So that way they don't have to make it completely solid. Probably saves a little bit of money doing it that way. This is awesome. Man, okay. Let's see. Do I need a spacer? Survey says. Yes, I will need a spacer. Let's see, which one am I going to need? I think I'm going to need one eighth. Maybe even both. Yep, it actually required both. Look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. Yeah, that is definitely worth the money, guys. If you want to pick one of these up, like I said, I will be linking it in the description below. This thing is gorgeous. Wow, now that is a display stand. Uh, I'm excited to check out some of their, they have holders like this that are wall mounts with a customized plaque on the front of it as well that I'm really, really interested in. I'll probably grab a couple of those myself and just check them out. This is beautiful. Do you guys see this? And anybody who wants one of these, this would be great for your Canon 1 and 6s that everybody is getting nowadays, uh, especially graded copies. Wow, that's beautiful. Okay. Anyway. That's it, guys. That's my product review. That is Red Wolf Collectibles over at Etsy. Link in the description below. Go check them out. I, I cannot recommend this enough. This is probably the nicest stand I have ever seen for a comic. This is absolutely amazing. It is just beautiful. Look at that absolutely gorgeous you know while you're at it hit up victor at gator guards and get some gator guards to put in these things instead of cgc <laughs> you know i'll link victor down below too i'll link uh, his gator guard website so you guys can check it out because i'm a huge fan of these as well wow that's amazing all right anyway that's it guys thank you for watching and uh, to my channel subscribers, you guys are awesome. To my channel members, your names are scrolling with a huge thank you. Like always, 
take it easy.